from the police precinct to the firehouse. Myrtle Beach first responders are entering their second month of new and better wages. Our Ian Klein joins us at the alert desk, breaking down how their salaries compare to years prior and detailing what led up to this change. Ian. Yeah, Rachel, Myrtle Beach Fire Chief Tom Guire says that the firefighter salaries have increased almost 30% over just the last two years, demonstrating the city's commitment to their first responders. They've done pay studies, they've done their research to see how we can compete, not just within Horry County, but within the state of South Carolina and, you know, really the southeast region. Uh, I mean, we're competitive with places like Charlotte and some of these other bigger departments. Myrtle Beach City Council voted to boost the pay in December for all city employees. After a recent study found the compensation was at or below market rate, especially for police and paramedics, the new rates took effect in January, ensuring that all city officials will make at least $5,000 more than they did last year. I'm told the pay increases don't just reflect workloads, but also help the important departments with recruiting and retention. The way things are going, uh, we've got to stay competitive to keep the good people um, working for the city of Myrtle Beach to provide the service that our residents expect. In 2022, the department responded nearly 15,000 calls for service, with over 50% being rescue and EMS. Firefighter paramedics will also see an increase with salaries starting near $60,000. You know, being in the fire service is never about the money, but obviously we have to sustain ourselves and our families and want to be able to do that comfortably. Uh, so it's, it's awesome that the city council and the, the community here is also behind us on that and trying to make us a competitive market. The salary boosts aren't the only improvements firefighters will see over the coming years. We've also got some new stations coming down the line where station one, station three are getting replaced completely. Uh, we have a brand new station seven, hopefully in the next five years, that'll be built the market common. We have a brand new fleet of trucks at the city council and community has allowed us to purchase and get rolling. Myrtle Beach Fire Department is also offering new firefighters a $4,000 relocation assistance. They have also annual performance bonuses for current positions like their ocean rescue team and even tuition reimbursement for new hires. At the alert desk tonight, Ian Klein, WMBF News.